Have you ever uttered the dreadful words, it's not going to work for me? I think most people have. And this is a very, very convenient way to limit yourself from ever achieving anything incredible or pushing yourself to your max potential. When you tell yourself that you cannot do it or that somehow someone else is special or they have some advantage that you don't have, you immediately disqualify yourself and put yourself in a position where you really can't help it, right? You're just a victim. You don't know any better. You're not going to be able to do it. And so any effort is all in vain. Look, do not tell yourself that this is not going to work for me until you've given it a solid try. I'm talking about at least 30 days. Almost anything will work after 30 days. If you start working out and you do it for a week, probably not gonna see much of a difference, but if you do it for 30 days, some things will start to happen. So then you have proof and now it's hard to say, well, it's not gonna work for me because it's working for me. On the other side of this as well, if you are the type of person that actually tells themselves, oh, I can do it and I will do it and you commit to things and you go all in, but you only try it for a short period of time, you essentially get the same result and then you tell yourself, well, I gave it my best shot. And that's another convenient way to make an excuse that keeps you stuck right where you are. So the key is the 30 day rule actually making a decision that you're going to commit to it. If you're going to start to paint, don't try it for a couple of days, try it for 30 days. If you're going to learn an instrument, practice a little bit every day for 30 days. Don't tell yourself, oh, I'm not a musician or that a bear stepped on my ear and therefore I cannot hear tonality properly. <laughs> it's a very good excuse, but it doesn't actually help you get what you want. So if you want to be a musician or if you want to be in great shape or if you want to learn more about business and actually being successful with an online business doing what you love, then trying it for a couple of weeks on and off here and there, it's never going to get you anywhere. And it goes for everything. So decide, decide, decide to do 30 days, commit yourself to 30 days at the very least before you ever write yourself off or tell yourself you can't do it or tell yourself that you've already tried or that you gave it your best effort and clearly it's not meant to be for you, really go all in for 30 days. And this is important because oftentimes you'll be very skeptical. So as you're doing the 30 days, you might kind of half-ass it because guess what? You don't believe that it's going to work. So you do things in a way to try to prove what you believe. So you gotta drop that and really go all in and really try your best, even though maybe in the back of your head, you know for sure it's never going to work because you've seen other people try it and you've tried it and it just never works. Just stick with it anyway, go all in anyway. Do it as if it's going to work, that is the key. You have to act as if it's going to work, otherwise, I guarantee you, it will not work. It cannot work because you're not allowing it to work. You're actually blocking yourself from even getting the result so long as you're telling yourself that it's not going to work or there's this downside or this other downside or this is annoying I don't like how this feels all of that is just going to ensure that you don't get what you want so make a firm decision if your goal is important to you if what you're doing it for actually matters really really double down on your commitment and your willingness to keep doing what is needed to create the result and forget everything else don't give yourself that time to sit there and say oh well I don't like how this feels this is a exhausting, you know, I might as well just stop right now and go back to my old ways. There's always time to go back to your old ways. Don't worry about it. They're not going anywhere. Okay. They'll be right there in the month from now. But if you commit to that 30 day rule, it is really magical, but you got to do it with all your heart and you got to make a real decision. So to make a real decision, drop it in the comments below. What are you committing to for 30 days? Are you going to learn dance? Are you going to learn an instrument? Are you going to finally start your online business? Are you going to improve your relationships with your family members? Making an effort once saying, oh, well, I tried, but my mom is just a bitch. <laughs> you know, that's not really gonna get you anywhere. But if you keep working at it, then it gets better and better and better over time and your relationships will improve. It's like that with everything. So make sure you don't tell yourself that it's not working when you're not giving it your all and you're not sticking to it. 
I hope that you enjoyed the video. Make sure that you subscribe and turn on your notification bell so that you don't miss a single upload. And if you'd like to experience a real breakthrough and some massive progress in your life, sign up for coaching. It's in the bottom left of your screen right now. If you click on that, you'll go to my website and you can book a free consultation to get us started.